Hello, everyone. Welcome to another Amigo Aaron Friday Night Disaster Stream. I want a new microphone tonight, so if you have any trouble hearing me, please let me know. So, what do we have in store tonight? <clears throat> I thought to myself, what's something wacky, I mean extremely wacky, that I haven't played on the old disaster stream that's not too difficult to rig up, you know, being lazy and all. And there was only one clear choice. And that was, bam, let's go to it now. That's right. It's the TurboGrafx slash PC Engine CD-ROM console. Tonight, we're going to play selections from the TurboGrafx. Actually, these are really PC Engine games. Uh, but uh, that is the... Uh, that's what I had on hand. So I thought, hey, we haven't delved much into the CD lands. It's funny, too, because uh, aside from the CD32, and really that was a, a, a just a small blip on the map of the CD-ROM, uh, the Turbo Graphics had pretty good success with CD-ROM. So I have picked out 10 games to try. These are as random as it gets. Okay, this is a combination of what I had on hand and what I thought I could get through uh, and play in English. And so, we're going to give it a shot. I hope everyone in the chat is happy with the old TurboGrafx CD. Uh, so, I've loaded up the first selection here. And this is called the 4-in-1. I believe this is some sort of a, an amalgamation of different titles. So, we might just flip through this one quickly. But let's give it a whirl. I'm, of course, playing on the ever-popular BAM uh, wireless generic fake Super Nintendo joystick. So here we go. Let's give this a whirl, shall we? I've already tested this stuff just to make sure it works. Look at that. You'll let me know if the sound is overwhelming uh, from myself or the system. All right, so hopefully... I think I've got it rigged up pretty well. I know that guy. I own a Turbo Graphics, but I don't have a CD. Me, <laughs> what? Yeah. <laughs> well, there, there you go. What's up, John Marshall? Hey, Explorer. By the way, I'm sorry I didn't see you creep in there, my friend. Uh, yes. So, yeah, I, and the CDs get a little expensive. So we've got here three selections. Uh, from the original. You know, I've never played Gates of Thunder. So, let's give that one a whirl. <laughs> I do like the fact that they've used Bonk in the selection screen. That's pretty cool. Uh, the Turbo Graphics, it used to be a system no one knew about, but the internet made it the darling, you know. Sort of like the Vectrix was. Uh, and now everyone knows about it, but it's a great little system. I, honestly, we're delving into uncharted territory here on these, so. I don't know what this game is. I'm assuming it's some sort of shooting game. Look at this. You know it's a CD game. It's got a cool intro. Oh, yeah. It's always a bald guy. Yeah. And a mustache. We get screwed. Look at this guy. Yeah. You're dating yourself, Ken. <laughs> Ooh, this is some Star Blazers action here. There they go. I can't tell if you're being serious, HSI. What's up, O-Rom? Listen. I couldn't stay away, despite the fact that we shot Amigos Thursday. I had to get me some. Plus, I wanted to try this new microphone out. I saw Rob Flack O'Hare mention that this looks like a Yeti. And it is, in fact, a Yeti uh, microphone that we had in the collection. I'm uh, moving the uh, other rig out to the arcade. So I'm going to try to use this thing. I'm hoping it sounds... I hope it sounds as good as the uh, other mics did. And this is a heck of an intro here. I hope the game lives up to the hype. Power glove. Oh, he's got a necklace of some sort. Oh, that must be his woman. Look at that guy. You know you're cool. Yeah. We get sick of that, HSI. I'm assuming you have a beautiful head, head of hair. Alright, well, me too, Rob. 
this is a bizarre cross section. If you think about it, the mirror mirror image version of me would be a clean shaven man with a beautiful head of hair. You know, Rob, you were part of the reason why I thought it'd be okay to make the switch. Because I always hear your audio and it sounds fine. And we've been afraid to fool with my audio because we've been tweaking it for years. But I thought the heck with it, we're going to go for it. So hopefully it sounds okay. Etsy. Man, she's making a fortune. I've wasted a lot of money on her various web pages. Does this ever start? I usually like to watch these, but dang. Look at that thing. It looks like the Space RV from Spaceballs. It's the voice of an angel. Look, the, pl the police. Do they pull you over in space? There, it, hey, what's up, Alan? Yes, there will be. By the way, I, speaking of uh, happy coding there, he has sent me some delicious morsels. So hopefully, if everything goes well, next Friday will be a, a ZX Spectrum show where I'm going to be featuring some of the goodies he sent over. All right, finally. Let's fire this sucker up. My joystick fell asleep. It took so long. All right, I was right there. Okay, here we go. All right, I think that's probably a good thing that just fell out of that ship. Oh, no! All right, this is one shot, one kill. That's not good. All right, here we go. Heat Seekers. Holy smokes! Right out of the gate. Oh, look at that! Oh, no! Man, I was doing... Okay. Okay. Okay, game. I'm gonna get this going here. Here we go. Now we're cooking. Look at that. I love the background. You know, as I recall, the Turbo Graphics was a combination 8 and 16 bit system. And uh, they really squeezed. They knew how to u make this thing sing. God, that's hard. Okay, I'm going to try that again. Oh, yeah. I'm not claiming that score game. Uh, can I continue? This is where they make you watch the whole intro again. Okay, here we go. Now, see, does that look fair? Seem fair at all. Oh, God! I mean, they lure you in right there. I'd like to keep hold of these. These are dandy. There we go. The problem when you get all those U's on the screen, it's kind of hard to tell which U is you. I will say this, I like the look of this game. It's quite smooth. I like, one thing I like about the uh, the backgrounds on, on, the, on these shooters that they make for this machine, they always have cool stuff going on back there. I would say the Turbo Graphics, in some ways, is, in some ways is a step up from the kind of games you'd see on the, like, I don't think the Amiga, you're going to go see a game like this. I'm not saying the Amiga couldn't pull it off, but I mean clearly the Amiga could pull off some of the games on the Turbo Graphics. Okay, I mean, everything you touch. It's a t like, what are you? All right, I'm getting it now. Stay in the middle of these. You get to learn these ships. That's the difficulty of it. Now, of course, I add in some extra difficulty. This ain't good. Kind of a rocking soundtrack too. Oh yeah. I don't know if that, that was a shield. Oh, well I had a shield. Oh, now I'm gonna be totally boned. I need that. Kill that. That ain't good. Kill it. Oh. <laughs> I like that though. Spotlight of death. Yeah, you know better than me, Ken. I can't. I don't think I can go up. I don't think I can go past. Yeah, I can't. So look at the look at the avenue of operation I've got here. I mean, it's practically you can't go anywhere. 
It's almost like I need an analog stick. The precise control it takes to get... My god! Okay, oh yeah. I can use those. Yeah, get out of here. Oh god! I don't know how it survived that. I thought those killed you. Oh, I didn't know I could even go down here. Oh god. They didn't believe in a learning curve on this one. Look at that. Look at the scrolling at the bottom. And then the top. Man, it's just beautiful. That is straight up money, yo. I'll be interested to see how many of these games really needed the CD to do anything. I don't seem to be hurting this guy. He's got a lot of guns. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna try one more time just to see if I can get past that guy. <laughs> that was embarrassing, I'll admit it. Do I get another continue? I do. Do I get to start at that guy? I don't. I start completely over. Okay, screw that. We're gonna move on. So that was... Oh, yeah, we're still playing the... Let me see if I can get back. See if it'll let me go back to the uh, main menu here. It won't. Well, that's okay. We'll just reload it. Reload that and try again. I don't have all the CDs available on here. I have picked out 10 to try. I figured I'd run through these and then call it a night. I do have the complete run of the CDs. I just don't have them all on here. Because I've got limited space on this card. That's why I didn't put them all on here. So... Correct. Yeah, by the way, this is the mister, in case you're wondering. Let's have a quick go at Bonk. I think we've most of us have already seen Bonk, but you can't you gotta play Bonk. Oh, thanks, Ken. You're as smart as you are handsome, my friend. Alright. This game's great. And this is also a good game on the Amiga. BC Kid was the name of it on there. I love that game. And Boat liked it too. Boat, I think, declared it the greatest, pla uh, the greatest uh, platformer on the system because he always does that. That's the boat. That's boat's gimmick. Let me see if I can remember how to play this stupid game. I know you smush these guys. There we go. There we go. And you can actually bounce those around for points, I believe. Nice like to have two buttons. I will say that. These things can sometimes screw you. You gotta be careful. That's the thing I hated, is that huge planet that follows you around. That thing, I don't, I, that, that was a poor decision. I know they had to get, they were working to get an angle there with that, but I didn't like it. That gummit. I actually own this game, by the way. <laughs> That's what... I... It's one of the few games I bought for the Turbo Graphics, but I own this one. Bonk was a great mascot. He had a lot of personality. One of these has got a baddie in it. There he is. Take him it. Get off me. This is ridiculous. I've got, it's hard to get used to playing this with two buttons after playing it with one for so long. There we go. I need health. There we go. That's what we need. Yes. It's also hard to get used to not jumping on guys to kill them. Every game you ever play has taught you to do that. It's funny you should say that, because I bought my TG in a pawn shop. I think I paid 75 bucks for it, and I knew these things were going to go up. That I knew. And so I bought it. I thought, you know, if I don't get one of these now... I had the same thought with the Jag, too. Uh... 
I thought there's no way this isn't going to go up. Because I could see the way the collector's market was going. And sure enough, they went way up. So. The funny thing is, the, uh, the, T the Turbo Graphics is, is a far cry from the PC Engine, which is a much better, it's a much more compact uh, piece of kit. There we go. Yeah, Hudson Soft, <laughs> uh, it's amazing to me, too. <laughs> Those guys. Because they were, man, what an outfit. They did great, great games. They had great hardware. It's a shame that they, and then the super, the super graphics. I don't know what they were smoking that week. They dropped the ball on that big time. <laughs> That's something else I like about the game. Yeah, there you go, pal. Uh oh. Yeah. Bonk angry theme. It's fun, you know, a lot of people don't bother with fooling with the headbutt and the bad guys. That's sort of, it's kind of fun. You can kind of get yourself going doing that. Oh no! Saved by the teeth. Oh no! Get out of here. Barely made that one. Oh, yeah, absolutely, dude. I agree. And and the thing is, uh, the other Bonk games are a little, they're quite a bit different. I mean, they're not, but they are, especially Air Zonk. It's really bizarre. I'm dead already. unusual. Alright. Now oh, here we go. This is this is pretty funny. There we go. You have to do this. There he goes. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> Swimming in the old. <laughs> like this level is insane. That's what I like about it. Like this is madness. Very creative. Gummit. No, no, no. Get up. Get up, dude. He's all right. This is, I, you know, this is, these are Ben Q files, but this sounds just like the Hue card music, so I'm guessing most of these did that, but I can't say for sure. Maybe somebody else in here is a little more familiar can comment. Yeah, the Hue cards are cool. Come on, get up in. I always have trouble here. Get up in there. You have to kind of eat and then kind of jump off. Dead gummit. Ah. 
Okay, wait a minute. Duh. I knew it was some trick to that. There we go. I think you can get up there. Oh, dang it. Is that my last man? Damn. Yeah, well, there you go. The old bonk. All right, we're going to move off the bonk CD. Let's move directly to the next thing in line. Some of these I tried. This is what I'm doing for boat. This is the uh, Adams family for this thing. Let's give this thing a whirl. By the way, if anyone's played any of these, let me know and tell me what you think. Here we go. That probably just loops, I'd wager. I wonder if that's enough to get me a uh, hose on YouTube. We'll find out. Yeah, not easy being you, Tully Alfred. But that's okay. Could have been worse. Could have been well, This is different. It's hard trying to live up to mother's lofty goals. Why couldn't you be more like your brother? How do you ever expect to make a living slaving over those extravagant weirdos, the Adams family? Hey, what about my goals? Oh, what's the use? Here I am again. Just Interesting. Like Too bad we couldn't do this so this is not going to be, be like the, uh... I have to yeah, <laughs> no kidding. Time I set foot on this property. Let's just get into that. Okay, enough of you. Not what I expected, frankly. Tully, my good man, how about playing a round of golf? Uh, sorry, Gomez. Yikes! I'm a bit busy right now. <laughs> okay. So, I'm playing as Tully in this. I can see why Tully turned on Gomez after seeing this. Man, is that... God, get off me! Jeez! That wasn't easy. I guess we're in the house proper. Now, it looks like we're... Is there, are we in, like, a movie theater? What am I looking at here? Oh, jeez. Man, am I missing that first shooter? Up oh, here comes. I hope I get more than one man. Okay, let me see if I can figure out what's going on here. Definitely two buttons. I think keep moving. That's the key. Oh God, I can't leave. Look at these bats! My god! Has anyone played this? No. No, it's not. It's a lot harder than the Munchers, and the Munchers was hard, brother. Ha 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 ha! might be right. Like, I can't figure out how to kill those bats. And they just swarm. I guess I don't know if you have to keep moving. Or... Like that bat. It's just, un it's just... What is it with bats? Bats and spiders. And you can't leave. It won't let me leave. I don't have another weapon. I wish I did. Oh. We might not spend too long on the old Adams family. Let's let's take a second here. Okay. Oh, you can't take a second. The stuff comes at you. If you clip these guys in the air, oh, the fact that 
the fact that he's throwing diamonds at me. Why would you want to play the jerk in the Adams Family movie? Wouldn't you want to play one of the cool people? Who wants the jerk to win? Who thought that was a good idea? That's a dud. That's a big old dud right there. I'm giving that my worst score ever. Ten thumbs down. Get that out. All right. Here's an oldie but a goodie. Buster Bros. Let's try that one. Well, you gotta remember, this is back in the day where janky title screens off CD were pretty much the par for the course. I'm interested to see why this is on CD. Choose a city, eh? Let's just start at the beginning. I don't wanna go crazy. I don't know. I think I... Oh, pang. This is one of these god-awful. I am no good at this game, but I will do my best. Believe, remember, this is on CD <laughs> for some reason. Jeez. Oh, I've never been good at this game. Is there a time limit? Oh, crap. Yes. This seems like every other version of Pang. Oh, yeah, man. It's coming back to me now. We covered this on the Amigos once. Um. Oh God! Oh, my God! Hey, oh! Ain't good. Was that a B? That can't be right. Good. Oh, what's a gun? Oh, yeah, here we go. Oh, no. Anybody want to guess as to why this is on? I wonder if this appeared as a Who card. Because why would you need this on here? I can't figure that out. Just to make money? It's to say, you see, this is a, uh, shoot. This must be a, a bit of the old, this must be a bit of the old, uh, 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 Amiga CD32 here. Cheap, easy ports. Maybe it was the CD sound that got him. You know what I mean? It sounds pretty good. Yeah, tell me about it. Oh, yeah. I got it now. Wonder what those who cards end up being up to expense wise.
Go banana. Here we go. What's the consensus from the chat? Do we like this game or I mean, I mean, I don't mean this particular one. But I mean, people always seem to like this game, and I've never understood the appeal. I've never liked it. It's hard. It's goofy. Shoot. No, come down. No! There we go. Hey, I made it to the next stage. That's not bad. Oh, good God. Get me off that. Oh. You gotta be kidding me, Curtis. By the way, hey, Curtis. I got one more continue here. I'm gonna give it one more shot here. This is a quick one. Hey, for you uh, folks that are watching now, uh, this time tomorrow night, it's going to be on, brother. It's the uh, Taze Valley Classic Computer Club on the Amigos channel here. It's going to be a happening. All your favorites will be there, including John Bodem Car Schaller, the Brent, the Brent's wife, Terry, the Chud will be in attendance. Good Matt will be there. Uh, John Marshall, who's in the chat right now, or he was, he'll be in attendance tomorrow night. And a special appearance by my good buddy, The Hose, will be there. So that should be fun. We're going to fix computers, have a few drinks. What's up, Super Tech Boy? What's up, Buck Owens? Holy smokes, now they're coming out. You guys missed some good radio shows earlier. We're playing Turbo Graphics CD. Because why not? Whoa. Now, what do you do about that? Oh, yeah. So you can't hurt anything. You just run through it. That's great. I'm, I'm ashamed of myself for that one. Yeah. You don't want that to happen. Man, that's not good right there, either. That's when those things explode your bone. Alright, we're moving along here. That was Buster Brothers. Okay, up next, we're going to play Castlevania Dracula X. We're going to give this a shot. You hear all about these Castlevania games? Holy smokes. Hey, listen... They're not my computers, Curtis, you know what I mean? <laughs> Someone's going to get hosed, but it's not going to be me. Konami! Oh, here we go. we got to watch some of this, at least. Now, is Dracula X, is that have an American name, or is that the American name? Or is this one of those games that didn't come out in America? Ooh, look at that. That's pretty cool. Is that what this is, Alan, or is this another game? It sounds like they're speaking German. And it's subtitled, I guess. It's kind of neat. Oh, yeah, man. Now we're working blue here. You know, Bone? Hey, Bone, by the way. Good to see you, man. You know, that's a good question, my friend. I don't know. Anyone in here know about modern TG? Oh, this is the old Rondo, is it? Whenever I heard Rondo of blood, it reminds me, remember Ronco? The old TV, uh, they used to sell, you know, pocket fishermen and stuff in the old days. That's what I always think of. It's not a good look for Dracula. The old Ronco dra of blood. Dracula's got a cool castle. Break on hair. Is that a hint, Buck? What are you trying to say? 
I heard that part. Count Dracula. Okay. I never got into these Castlevania games. However, when I did that, uh, when I did that modern 16-bit show with the Brent, we played a game for the N64. Or excuse me, for I played a game for the uh, for the Mega Drive, and it was. They say it's very similar to this, and I liked it, so I'm willing to give it a shot here. Okay. I don't think I'm gonna have room. I'm so arrogant though. I'll just put it. There we go. Cool music on this. Here we go. That you know, I wonder why that is. Because it seems like they'd be a cool format to use. I know the CDs aren't copy protected. Oh, yeah. That's cool. Oh, yeah. Come on, Alan. Don't hate, brother. That's all you need. That's every Hammer movie was based on a similar plot. And everybody knows Hammer was awesome. Oh, man. Uh-oh. Now you know what? He, he took off his business clothes. He put on his Ryu outfit. Cool, yeah. I got it. Headband. Yeah. I've got the Atari, but I don't have a CD for it. But I don't have the ex expensive cart that lets you play the CDs. But that's how they're doing homebrew. Man, look at this. He's splinging crosses. Here we go. After that cool intro, it's time for me to make that guy look real dumb. Holy smokes, what's going on here? Oh, here we go. That's pretty cool right there. Prologue. Stage zero. You can ever watch the Hammer House of Horrors series? It was great. Am I playing yet? No. Okay. <laughs> That ain't good. Man, right out of the gate, I'm fighting death? Jeez. Okay, death. Oh, God. I can't even get to this guy. All right. That's bad when you can't make it past the prologue. Whoa, hold the phone. I took out his side. Oh, he didn't like that. That ain't good. That ain't good. Oh, God! Holy smokes. Yes, I did get that link happy. Thank you. Okay, we're back. Oh, I see that didn't hurt me. Yeah, this is a Castlevania I'm familiar with. Hit the hit the thing and the Look at these guys. Listen to the music. Nice. There's a lot of dead hunchbacks in this world. I guess I shouldn't go that way, should I? Oh, come on. There you go. Let me, let me knock that crooked back straight. Alright. Oh, man. I do like the music. It's quite good. Whoa, Christ! This is the stuff I don't like. Going around just whacking barrels and crap. That gets old. Same thing I have probably have with Zelda. I mean, who's going to do that in real life? You look like an idiot. Oh, man. Whoa, look at that guy. Alright, here we go. 
By the way, can I go in any of these buildings? I guess not. Oh. Yeah. Okay. This looks pretty cool. Oh, that ain't good. What's that? What is that candle hooked to? Oh, again with the bats? Please tell me I get another guy. Don't make me start all over. Thank you. How do people get good at this? I... Die! Holy crap! Bring back the bats! Bring back the bats! Oh, God. come here. Alright, big boy. Let's dance. Oh, shoot. Don't jump into the punch. Got it. He shoots... Now, that seems overkill. The guy's a huge stone guy. Oh, by the way, he shoots fire. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Anybody need some gravel? <laughs> now, this seems silly. What are these sconces hooked to? Another one? So this guy's just a guy that just appears? I'm guessing I'll get a weapon that makes this guy like a, a real geek after a while. Shoot. Yeah. Another sconce in the middle of nowhere. Scott's full of money. What's up, Dave? How's it going, man? Man, I love wrecking lamps. My favorite. Is that a dragon up there? What was that? Oh, God! Oh, good God, no! Can we go in here? Oh, crap. Oh, man! Oh, jeez! I knew it. Oh, good God, it shot out! Oh, God! Oh, good God, no! Come on, give me one more. Give me one more chance. I see him back there. Anybody give me a quick hint? Who can give me a hint? At least it sounds like he's hurting. Yeah. I don't want any more fire, though. Can I shoot that fire? No, you can't shoot the fire. Yeah. How about that? Oh, God! It, it bounced all that way. Oh, yeah. Axis. Forgot about those. Oh, God! He's got... What the heck was that? Dead gummit. Uh-oh! Not good! Not good! Oh! Thanks, uh, thank you, O-Rom. Yeah, they put a lot of attention to beating me like a dog. Like a drum. Well, you guys are real full of it tonight. Don't die. I'm not sure how am I shooting those axes. Somebody tell me, oh God, he's back. He didn't even wait for me that time. Oh, God. Oh, no! No! No, no, no! Oh, yeah. Yeah. You didn't like that, did you? Oh, God! 
Oh god, not that! What is that? Oh good god, no! I know this is painful for some of you. That was Dracula X. I think I'll uh, save an end on that one. Holy smokes. Take off, HSI. I can see why you're in charge of the funny pictures, my friend. All right, next on the docket, I hear a lot about this game, the old cotton. It's not the kind of cotton you pick. Yep. I believe this is what uh, the boys over at Pixel Gaten call a cute em up. Yeah. Who doesn't like these? Me, that's who. But by God, we'll play it anyway. We'll see if I do any better on this than I did on the last one. Man. That happens occasionally here in West Virginia. The old evil mist will throw off the prism. You get you a good old boy with a pitchfork and a fan. Take care of that. You know I am, O-Rom. Here she comes. <laughs> you got that right. Listen, I was in a prism earlier today, I might add. And it was way out of whack. It was literally full of evil mist. They just painted the little room I was in. Yeah. The, the evil witch looks uninterested in this. Yeah, I've been out of high school for three years, Curtis. By the way, you old. <laughs> Let's go. I like to just grab a fairy, take him around with me. They love that. They love when you do that. They're cool with it. Here we go. It's fairy time. Sorry, it's hard to get excited. It looks like fairy Miss Piggies are coming after me. Yeah. Yeah. I'm assuming those are bad. Yep, they sure are. I think the only time I've ever played this, I think Boat picked it for uh, for the Turbo. Actually, I think he picked it on this machine. Now I think about it, isn't this game like super expensive? Am, am I crazy, or is that this? Isn't that this game like the Hue card for it's like worth like eighteen billion dollars? I like personally. I like horizontal ones better. Your Galagas and this and the like. These eyes are suspicious looking. I'm not gonna lie to you. Oh shoot! I know I can hit that wall. Yeah, let's try. Let's keep going here. I'm getting my groove on here. You know there are some streamers, and you tune in. You're like, man, let's see how they're gonna see how quickly they can beat the game or whatever. Then there's some that uh, well. You just sort of tune in and think to yourself, how's this guy streaming? He's so bad. I could do this. And you're right. What in God's name is that? Oh, jeez. Oh, come on. From the rear of the Miss Piggies? Okay, let's try this one more time. Cool mood. Oh, jeez! Yeah, he'd be, he'd be right to do so. I think we played the American, the English-sized version of this. I wonder if it was E. I don't remember having this much trouble. I don't really remember any of this. And I'm sure we played this on an episode. 
A real, oh, it's, I know, it was, well, I think it was an ARG that boat was still on. I have to go back and check. Yes, double fairy action, brother. Oh, man, how the hell? Is it me? Is it me? We're gone. We're moving on. Next up, a, hopefully, a beat-em-up called Fighting Street, or possibly a fighting game. I'm not sure. Fighting Street. Clever name. I'd have never come up with that one. Oh, I see. This is Street Fighter 1. Oh, man. Yeah. By the way, Bone, me and me and Boat played uh, the WrestleMania VCR game yesterday live. And if, if Boat can find some way to post it, he's going to. Otherwise, you can go check it out at the uh, uh, Amigos... Uh, Twitch channel. We actually had a good time, by the way, playing that. We played three rounds. I think we all know who won that one. Yeah. You are not Michael P.S. Hayes, Flack. Sorry. I hope you're singing the song quietly to yourself. No, come on, man. It's Street Fighter. Hogan! Yes, no kidding, Rob. You're lower than you're less than Buddy Roberts. Oh man. It talks. Let me see here. I can figure out the controls. Oh, it's it's got a little yard kung fu in it. And I like yard kung fu. By the way, uh, in the chat now is a man who actually did a uh, show on Yar Kung Fu, as I recall, in his old Sprite Castle. If you care to check out the C64 version of Yar Kung Fu, not this game. I don't think you ever have you covered this game on the channel, Flack. Goodbye, jerk. Yeah. There was HSI. I'm pretty sure there was. There it is. What's up, Tree Mosher? Do you have a friend called Tree Thrasher? And if you get that joke, let me know. Here we go. Let's kick this. Kick the I like the music in this. I'm assuming that's the CD aspect of it. Yeah, don't bring that fancy crap here. Oh, there it was. I was wondering if I could do one. Man, he whooped my hind. Okay, Daddy. Yeah. CC Sport got a pretty good version, too, I think. All right, pal. Michael. It sounds like the announcer is saying, Michael! <laughs> This is the way we do it in, after the bar closes. Just kneel down and repeatedly hit your opponent in the groin. How am I losing this? I beat the tar out of this guy. Oh, come on. Oh! That's right. You got that right. By the way, at my old karate tournaments, most of the time they were fair game. I was old Flip Kick Aaron, they called me. Yeah. Take a hike, loser. <laughs> you just did the job. In the opening bout, I might add. Don't forget there are many gods like you all over the world. That's easy for him to say. <laughs> oh, man. This is going to be a tougher bow. Mike looks rugged. My guy, not so rugged. He's got David Bowie eyes and a dumb haircut. Here we go. Oh, look at that. Isn't that nice? At least we're somewhere scenic. Yeah. New strategy. Jump around like idiot, kick in face. Ow, my face. 
Old strategy, groin shot. Oh, you guys got a reach advantage on me. How am I losing? How am I losing? I've kicked the crap out of that guy. Ex somebody explain that to me. His shots did like twice as much damage. What are we doing here? If we're going to have a crappy game, at least play fair. I noticed that in the last round. I was kicking the tar out of this guy. Look at his shots. He's hit me twice. How was... How is that fair? The flare. All right. Screw you, game. This is an insult. This is an insult. Oh, not that shtick. I'm going to try this one more time. And we're moving on. Yes, Art of Fighting 1 was way better than this. Way better. Let me tell you something. R Ryu looks like an idiot with this hair. Yeah, take off HSI. Don't rub it in. I'm going to listen to O-Rom. Repeated groin shots. That's the key. You can't let this guy hit you one time. Look at the damage. Listen, if you can't hurt a guy and he's crushing you, just leave. This is embarrassing. This guy looks a lot tougher. His picture. Look. Anybody play this in the arcade? Was it like this in the arcade? Because I can see where this game failed. That's dud. Numero duso, or ichi, it's, that's, no, that's each, or knee, knee, Japanese for two. Remember that from okay. okay, that stinks. This should be interesting. I picked this one specifically for our Amigo buddies. This is the expensive, highly controversial, it came from the desert version of the CD, TurboGrafx CD. So here we go. This literally killed the company of CinemaWare. Let's see what happened. I hope this works. I haven't tried it yet. This should be a fascinating look here. It came from the desert. This is a whole different game than you saw in the Amiga. Yeah. The Sea of Love. <laughs> well, that is music. I'm going to hit start here and hope we won't skip anything. Oh, it won't let me. Okay, there we go. I don't know, Oram. Somebody had their deluxe paint, like, uh, font kit out. Dr. Demento? Oh, no, it's the Amazing Randy. They build cities, wage wars, take slaves to work their underground farms. Some can even fly thousands of feet into the sky and travel across vast oceans. But they never kill for sport. That is solely the domain of Homo sapiens. Hey, Doc, my old man hunts jackrabbits. I don't think he's a Homo sapien. <laughs> no, I, I don't believe he is, Buzzer. But enough of that. Let me show you my latest endeavor. I've rigged up a high-powered television camera on the roof. 
From here, I can see everything from the highway to Barbecue Pass. Let's see what the good citizens of Lovelock are up to today. Remember, th it came from the desert. Remember that. That's this game. I've never seen this. I've never played it. I've seen snippets. So this is this is brand new to me as well. <laughs> One of the locals, Buzz. I see he's out shooting jackrabbits with his big shotgun again. For fun. Ah, there's what I'm after. The wreck on the highway. A bad sign. Very bad. That's the atomic waste truck that cracked up last ah, night. No kidding, it? Wish. It was no accident. Its deadly cargo had vanished by the time the sheriff arrived. That can only mean one thing, Buzz. I want you to get out to Borax and... <coughs> reactivate my sensor grid. Your old radiation sensor grid? You haven't used that since the A-bomb test. And why Borax? That old ghost town gives me the creep. Getting a little blue. Well, this place is still Fun Town, USA. Hey. All right. This is where you kick into the interaction. Go to Borax Saloon. Ha ha ha! Man, that saloon's like crap. Oh, man. This guy went to the boat school of performance. You ever hear rhythm changes like that, kid? Well, now you have. Now you sure have. Yeah, they suck. Now listen up. You want the girl, you want knowledge, or you want strength. Now what's it gonna be? You probably want the girl, right? They usually do. <laughs> Is he a ghost? What's happening? Oh, I get to pick one. Okay, chat, I'm gonna leave it to you guys. Do we want knowledge, strength, or the girl? Quick, type it in. You got, uh, say, 10 seconds. So quickly, type in what you want to see. Looks like the chick. Well, see, you guys mock that old man for looking at that chick, but look at you. I think the, the low brows are spoken, and I concur. Here we go. Sorry. Sorry, Explorer. You knew how it was going to go down. And Bone. Ken. Oh, look at this. We should have picked Strength. Hi. Come closer. Oh, don't be shy. Uh, you're in a huge pit of lava. I'm Marina. I know. You're Buzz. <laughs> We're an act. Play me, Man of Steel. We play Vader. These are just Temporary lodging. The cops leave us alone up here. Well, you know all about the cops, don't you? You're one of us, Buzz. I can feel your pain. Put her back with me. There isn't much time. Take the power. Remember, it came from the desert. Remember that. Whoa. Later, at the foundry, the watchman is one of them. Man, I'm gonna i I'm gonna grab that animation. I can tell you that right now. That will be on the stream next time you see it. The sensor checked out, okay? Whoa, what's that rumbling sound? Whoa! Now we didn't hear the sound, but we'll take his word for it. <laughs> oh no! I think I accidentally bombed myself, but I don't know how. Man, those things are bad news. I better hit the road. K O O L, the voice of the desert. 99.9 .9 on your FM dial. Prissy on line 5. Speak to the cool man. Hello? Cool man? You got me, babe. Well, I've got
got the sort of boyfriend, but he's not part of the Cool club. man, not a good no, DJ name. I mean, he kisses really cool, but he thinks this town really sucks flavor straws. He wants to take me to California on his motorcycle. What's a flavor hey, straw? Around, Chris. This town's going to be action central real soon. And listen, dump this jerk. He sounds like a real loser to me. What do you want to hear, babe? We'll see of love. Of no! We heard see a love. Requested song of the night. See of love. This is Cinema Warriors version, by the way. That they made this. Um. Any thoughts? Atomic Cafe. This ruined this company. This this put them out of business. Look it up. It's good stuff on it on YouTube. Look at this geek. Oh, hey, buzzer man. What's taking, babe? <laughs> Besides that paint mixer you're sitting on. Hey, there's a new show at the drive-in tonight. Maybe I'll ask Prissy. I mean, hey, you don't even have a car, right? <laughs> oh, like my new truck? Yeah, well, uh, I'm the new slug bug cat in town. Attention crawling and flying slime. Sunny back, and it's dying time. <laughs> Hey, come on by my shop. I'm giving out free boxes of rat poison. <laughs> Check you later, man. Are those jokes? Has anyone ever used a straw that has a flavor built into it? You can talk all you want, Buzz, but everybody says that you were involved in that big truck crack up the other night. I thought we were going someplace together, Buzz. Maybe California? Just bring me a Any Dr. Pepper. It's a hellhole of a town. <sighs> Give me a piece of Atomic Pie, Pris. I'm having a bad day. Oh, I didn't think of those HSI. Give me Atomic Pie, you get a free pull. Over there. Over there. I don't know if I should eat an Atomic Pie. That sounds rough. Well, that didn't go too good. Well, again, this is the this I want to reiterate, this is the Turbo Graphics, an 8 slash 16 bit machine. This is lower end than the than the uh, Sega C D. Well, after an atomic pie, it's time to go load up on ammo. That's the way I look at her. There's very little gameplay in this game. Whoa. Where'd you think you were going, Lincoln? California? I hear you've been nosing around out in Florida. Who sent you out there? That friend of yours? That old crackpot doc? You think you got this thing all figured out, don't you? Oh, figure this out, smart ass. Don't kill him yet. What's happening? What you come here for, boy, huh? You gonna Ammo? Give yourself a big old piece to keep away the boogeyman? <laughs> Everybody knows you killed Ben Hubbard. I don't know, Bob. Bomb stuff out of his truck. <laughs> What'd you do? Sell it to buy reefer, huh? <laughs> <laughs> this is it came from the desert you know, for the Turbo Graphics CD. Yeah, in case you, you were wondering. Yeah, this got fit right in, John. You better watch yourself, boy. You better. You guys got a Tommy gun out in the desert? That's a, I didn't expect to see that. I've got to tell Doc what's going on. This game, this is the game that plays you. <laughs> oh, more of this guy. Well, just put the and joystick down. It was, it was the size of a Buick. Shadows of unseen monsters in a haunted ghost town. Uh-huh. This is the stuff of cheap, vulgar pulp fiction, Buzz, not good science. On the other hand, I am already getting sensor readings since you activated the network. 
surprisingly high in the vicinity of the foundry too did well, we activate the network at some point that i miss truck accident yeah he's A1? good by being but, bad it doesn't match the particle spread of nuclear waste and if it's what i think it is it's far worse than a bomb buzz far worse now scat young man i must make some more observations and calculations no no this was specifically made for the game, but believe it or not, this series it came from the desert was turned into a theatrical release. There is a movie you can go rent or watch called It Came From The Desert. Tunnels, Doc. The ants are digging tunnels under everything. How do we know this? Oh, you found tunnels? We know! What else do ants do but dig tunnels? You thought they were going to come down Main Street on floats like the Easter Parade? What bothers me is, why didn't I think of that? I'm an old bud brain buzz, that's why. I agree. The buggers will tunnel under the whole damn town and pop up wherever they please. But the queen is down there somewhere. There's your real target. Here are two miniature TV transceivers. We can talk to each other using these. What, were you hoping for an atomic ray gun or something? This is the best I can do, boys. Better take them and get to work. I've got a motorcycle. Why am I staying again? Oh, Miyagi. More of this guy? Was there something else, Buzz? Uh, yeah. Hey, listen. I ran into the sheriff. I mean, he was acting crazy. You know, like my old lady gets when she's on mill towns, you know? Anyway, he, he was gonna shoot me, but something like grabbed a hold of him and he couldn't shoot. The old lady was on what? It's beginning already. They've taken over his mind. He's become an ant droid. Uh, and there may be others. Buzz, and, and, and they won't be easy to kill. Think of it. The whole I'm going to pretend I didn't hear that line. Turned into an army of blood-crazed ant zombies. Well, what are you waiting for? The world to end? Get out there was, Ken. <laughs> ant droid. All right. Kind of I'd love to control thing. something. But I'm not waking up. Maybe I forgot to set my alarm. I better get home. This is sort of like a theatrical release, Beach Bum. Somebody by now. Line two, Billy Bob. I saw it. It was huge. It was heading for lunch. It ain't my poodle. <laughs> <laughs> it ain't his poodle. Again. It's an eerie, unsettled evening on the desert, boys and girls. <laughs> in this town without pity. Here's city without sin. Man. Can I do something? Anything? Please don't show the old man again. I'll do anything. Well, okay, what's going on here? So, Mr. Big Shot, riding around on your fancy cycle all day? Yeah, Roy, you tell this ungrateful lodge of ours how it's going to be from now on. You tell him what we decided. Go on now. Remember, this got released for sale. Stuff. You ain't learning nothing, and we got no money for fancy college stuff. And your stepmother and I decided that instead of you going back to school next week, that you're going to start with me down at the site. There's no better job in this town, and that all that book stuff ain't going to do you no good with the boys down at the plant. Dad, the plant's a time bomb. They got leakage and busted containers. Man, this is hitting too close to home here in West Virginia. The doc figures. The doc, it's always the doc this and the doc that. That old mill case, what does he know? You ought to show some respect from the folks who raised you, ungrateful little punks. Hit him, Elroy. Let him have it. Hit him. Get me a beer, Ruth. Now, we done told him. Ain't that enough? Yeah. I think Ruth's running the show there, by the way. Yeah, they said, we're too cheap to send you to school. You're going to work at the plant. We've heard that a few times around here. The voice in your mind. I hear you listening out there. Wouldn't it have looked better just to graphically generate this? Getting sleepy. Why would you make it look like that? You could just make it look good. And gross. No, no, that's the feature of the Ground Zero Motor movie this week. Invasion of the Pod People. I want every hard loving, hard rocking cat and kitty down there tonight for the lover special. Two free breath mints and a jumbo tube of chapstick for all of those tired kissers. Still not playing. Speaking of which, here's snacks with fog up the windows.
I guess I'm just hanging around the house listening to the radio, and this is the simulation game version. <laughs> Any thoughts? Hey, in the old game, the drive-in would do stuff. Mitch, how can you walk out on this? Is this double platinum gold? <laughs> We've already been to Borax. <laughs> I'm gonna go. I want to. I want to see the drive-in. I'm gonna jump in on this one. Hey, look! I got to do something. Huzzah! Here we go. Oh, great! We get to... Is that the geek that had the pest control van? It is. Good night, Mitz. Hey, Buzz, what are you doing up there? We're trying to watch the movie here. Oh, my God! Now get lost before I exterminate you. I am so embarrassed I could just croak. Woo! Oh, jeez, I give up. You can both rock dead. Send a warning to the world. The pod people are coming. The pod people are coming. When? Quickly, please. I don't know, Tech. Well... Someone requested it. Let's go back here and see if anything's happened. I had a fun. Oh, no. Hey, man. It's late. You must be hurting. You take what you need and leave the rest. <laughs> yeah. yeah. No kidding. It's up to you, Jackson. <laughs> man. Suddenly, I'm glad Bloody Gun Murphy died. Is he murdering a cat? Well, we've already gotten the girl. Strength, I believe, was the next choice we had in mind. So let's go for that. I know this is horrible, but I can't help myself. But watch this. Hey! Huh? What's with those atomic pie things you've been scarfing? You got any idea what's in those things? A cornucopia of crud. You are what you eat, punk. Eat this. The secret of Superman. Kelp tart. Chew it up good, because there's always a few extra squid parts in there. Enjoy. Okie dokie. Oh, no. Please don't make me go back around the horn. Voice of the desert. Lovely Linda on line one. Talk to cool man. Sometimes I look at the desert sky at night, and I just want to cry. It's so beautiful. All the blue and red glowing stars. But my life down here is so awful. This is a really mean, dirty little town. People here have no hope. I can see... This is the company that made Wings, TV Sports Basketball. It made the Amiga with the fit of the crown. Shooting out from my radio tower. It came in like a lion and went out like a lamb. Up and out through the cold black void to one day reach those diamond white and blue yeah. stars. This moment... I shot this in my... Your the oldest and weakest camera I've got. That's what this is. With love and joy. These, these places exist. You must, you must believe me, dear. I can't skip these, by the way. You, cool man. Thank you. Play me a song. For Linda. Better than a jazz guy. <laughs> Thank you, Buck. Oh! That was day one? Listen. We've already gotten the shaft. Let's go to the atomic plant. I need... I, no! No HSI! We're not playing that many days, I assure you. Oh, not yeah, these two. Nerve showing your face here. I suppose you don't know nothing about the plant being broken into last night. They found motorcycle tracks out by the security fence. You're gonna end up doing hard time if you're involved, boy. Hard time. Make her listen to me, Dad. It's a frame job. Hard These time. Coming to get us, to kill all of us. They need this atomic waste for something, something terrible. That's just science fiction, bud. That tries to spring to fill in your head full of nonsense. Now the sheriff wants to see you this afternoon. I will say the digitization of this is in line with the acting prowess. 
I thought they'd be happy I showed up for work. Well, looks like we're going to the mine shaft. Let's go. This old mine shaft's a dead That's an indictment of my live stream, Happy. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, should we go in the mine? Let's do it. Mine. <laughs> would you allow yourself to be interviewed if you were behind this? I would shoot at the nearest cameraman. Oh, here we go. Yes. Oh. Man, this is worth this is where it all is worth it. Look at that. Yeah. That one got a little close. Oh no, no way to go that way. Oh. Hey, at least this is the only time we ever see the ants. We haven't seen them hardly except for this one scene. That would have went down easy. Cave okay, in. I hope there's no I hope I don't need to keep track of where I'm supposed to be going here. Oh, he's a fast one. Okay. I've got no idea. Whoa, good God. Oh. Ah, ah. Holy smoke. Yeah, that's right. I'm the king of this game. Oh. Dude, I made it. Look, it's just like flashback. Exact same game. Come on, I need some video celebrating my prowess at that shooting area. Oh, God! Cave zone! Oh, God! Oh! Man, those are hard. Man, those things are bad news. I better hit the road. So how did I get away from the ant? Oh, no. Oh, thank you, Hot. Thank you. Not the professor, though. Oh! That ain't good. Take off HSI. What are you doing to me? Who would watch that? <laughs> oh, God! I'm not very fast. Uh oh, that ain't good. This is sim crap, bum. Hey, check this out, y'all. Oh, thank God. There it is. <laughs> I have a feeling this is from the makers of the, uh, the people that heard our review of Zool. And they were like, oh yeah, making fun of our aunt? We'll get you back. I don't know what I'm supposed to do here. This is the new Barbie. That's all I need. Okay. Yeah. Maybe I need to grow up. The oh, good God. That didn't work. Oh, God! Yeah! Time to go on the offensive. Yeah. I'm starting to wonder why we're so scared of these things. The problem is there's nowhere to go. I don't have anywhere to leave. Oh, 
Oh, okay. I found a way out. Boy, you didn't enjoy that that harrowing, painful noise? Whew. I'm still breathing, I guess. I better hit the road. No! Why were you on foot if you've got a motorcycle? Okay. Let's go one more round here. What do you guys want to see out of these four choices? We have not been to the sheriff's. We could go there. Or that we could go to wherever you want. This is your last choice. Because this is killing me physically. It hurts me. No! <laughs> are you are you out of your mind? Yeah, no kidding. Fine, I'm going to go to see the sheriff. Yeah, Santa's in the lab. That's true. That's why I don't want to go there. We hate him. Let's go to so the sheriff. Surely he can't... Oh, wait, the sh isn't the sheriff evil? Well, maybe he'll kill us. That might be funny. Because apparently you can't be killed. I'm glad you came down to see me, Buzz. Your father and I are very worried about you. You've displayed a certain... anti-social behavior lately. And in a small town like this, everyone's got their eye on you. I've been told to give you one more <laughs> chance to join in with the community. To become one with us. Aren't you tired of being a loner? An individual? That beats being a bug, huh, Sheriff? Oh, we're mocking him? Get out. We'll find you. This is our town now. There's no place you can hide. <laughs> He's not that creepy, Flack. <laughs> I think some of these guys worked for CinemaWare. Okay, listen. We're going to move on. Although I do see if I get feel if I if the booze is involved, I'm going to play a full run through of this game, and then I'll also do a playthrough of Brent's game from a couple weeks ago. I'm your man. That'd be a nice one-two punch. So there you go. That was oh man, that was uh, it came from the desert right there. Here's a change of pace. Let's move over to check out Jack Nicholas Golf. That's a huge change of pace. Yeah. But we'd have, we'd have to do it. Here's the way I want to do it, okay? I'm going to do a stream of that, and I'm going to go into the Discord and open a room, a voice room. And I want people to come in and talk with me while I'm playing, and you can give me suggestions. I've been thinking about doing that, so I'll work on that. That'll be fun. Sort of like a conversation from the dark side. Just come in and you can chat with me. This time I don't have to invite you. You can just come in. All right, let's see what we got here. I've been wanting to play uh, I'm Your Man on stream. I don't know if I can put it on YouTube, but I can probably play it on here. All right. Now, this was a game that got made it over to the uh, to the uh, Amiga. There you go, HSI. That's right, man. Listen, I'm a man of the people. And if the people want me to be violently uh, cause uh, super amounts of pain to play a game, by God, I'll do it. Okay. I think of all these. I know I've played on Castle Pines before. We want match play. Let's see here. I am human. That is true. Male, correct. A, A. This is a complete 180 from... I was not prepared for what that... I'd heard about that game. You can't prepare yourself for something like that. Let's put a computer player in there. Oh, God! Lars X. That sounds pretty cool. Let's play around here. No one needs to practice. That's for suckers. Welcome to Castle Anybody Rock here Spartan remember old Jack? In Castle Rock, he was a pretty good, pretty successful golfer back in the day. Let's see how this stacks up with the Amiga offerings of the time. Well, it stacks up there with the slowness. Yeah, that's what I was just thinking. <laughs> I feel like I should be golfing with dynamite. Okay, this looks like one of your classic uh, gimmicks here. 
I see the holes up here. So we're just going to do a straight. Let's see how this works. Not well. That probably wasn't too good. Hit the tree. We got to figure out this how this meter works. I'll watch Lars X do it here and see how he does it. No, <laughs> no, it's not that good. Let's see what Lars X does here. All the way up. Oh, I see. Okay. You want to stay out of the red. Got it. Good sound. I'm assuming this was on CD for the music and for uh, the uh, all the courses. Yeah. Come on. Come on, Optimus. <laughs> I've heard that. All right, here we go. Let's see if I can get get back on the in the game here. Nothing nothing is more fun about golf than watching the screen draw. That's the best. Never gets old. All right, let's try this again here. Holy smokes. Okay, I well I, did it, I don't know how I did there, to be honest with you. Yeah, no kidding, bum. <laughs> you know, Beach Bum, I see your name in our in our streams all the time, but I don't know if I've ever talked to you for more than a few words. <laughs> so, it's amazing to me that of all the things, you, you rolled in just in time to see it came from the desert. <laughs> okay, let's see where I'm at. That's all right. Hey, I, I'm glad you're human, brother. Okay, in the dirt. Okay, I've got to try to figure out how to do this here. So I was holding the button. I think it's a click-click gimmick here. Click-click pull. Yes, that's what it is. Oh, 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 shoot. Okay, that was not bad. Look at this. And we're moving on. I'm not a fan of this particular offering. I'll be honest with you. Yeah, I know. I know that now. H, where were you ten minutes ago? Come on, help help a brother out here. That yeah, the game has scarred you. It scarred you. Would you get in the hole on the roof? Oh. Oh, well done, dude. Have you actually made anything with the destruction set there, bum? <laughs> Damn it. Oh. Man, people were a lot more patient back in the day. I remember playing world-class leaderboard golf on my PC... And on the Amiga 1000, and just sitting there forever while that thing rendered. And I was just like twiddling my thumbs or watching TV. Well, no kidney won the hole. Trust me, he lost the hole because he doesn't exist anymore. Let's try another port. We'll do a quick run on this one. I just want to see what it looks like. This is John Madden's American football. Everyone likes football, right? Looks like you hit a tree, Jim. Hi, I'm John Madden. My God. John Madden has three frames of animation. All right. Let's see what we can do here. Okay. I'll be Dallas. Let's play uh, our hate. Wow, there's not that many teams. Here we go. Let's play, oh, let's play New Jersey. They don't even have a team. Uh-huh. Dome. All right, that sounds good. Look at that. <laughs> New Jersey, not a real team. It's nice that they, because clearly this didn't have an NFL license. So they gave Jersey their own team. A lot of people don't know this, but the New York Giants play in New Jersey. Or they did. I'm not sure if the new stadium's there or not. Let's see. Jersey Captain Call it. If I know the Jersey team, they've somehow... Oh, look at that! Bam! That was better video quality than we saw in the other game. Oh, look at that! It's a quarter. You can tell what it is. Uh 
Let's see here. I will, uh... Well, I wanted to receive, but that's, I just screwed that up. That's all right. Here we go. This is the old school. This is very much like the Amiga version of Madden in terms of the way the layout is. and it doesn't look as nice. In fact, they're kicking towards us. Interesting. That's a good kick by me. Let's see if we can pitch. There we go. All right. Wow, this looks pretty bad. You went to a Giants game? You know, the Giants, have, no offense to you, O'Rom, because I'm sure you're a sweetheart, but it, it's, it's known throughout the world that the Giants have some of the worst fans on earth. You better be happy that the Phillies and the Browns are still around. They are the worst. Man, I, this is hard to... You know, we did a review. We, we did ARG Presents. Look at that. Look, they they paid six guys to set the crowd. <laughs> See you later, Happy. Oh, my God, Happy. I hope you're just getting up as opposed to going to bed. <laughs> good luck. Have a good day, my friend. You may be onto something there, dude. Interception. Yeah, that was me, by the way. I had a couple hours to run under that one. There was no problem. <laughs> Let's see what we got here. Let's start off with a little... Let's try that. Good luck, Happy. Man, I don't like anything about this game. I don't like the way it plays. I don't like the way it looks. I don't like the way the guys look. I hate every part of it. Not good. Let's see how throwing is. Did I catch that? I did! First down. I know. I do like that. There's one part of the game I like, and that was it right there. And I like that. Anytime. Could they not get a real crowd? Is it that hard? You had to go with that. <laughs> I had to laugh. Yeah, come on. Give it up for me, ladies and gentlemen. Look at that guy. <laughs> oh, that made it all worthwhile right there. Holy smokes. <laughs> Shoot. What a geek. Yeah, good idea, Flack. That way I can always be over even when I'm not, which is pretty much always. Look at that. And see, now this is when you quit while you're ahead. That's it. It's good. It's good. Thank you, Geek. We're out of here. We got two more games to try. We're going to get through these suckers. This next one, I wanted to try because you know I'm a big fan. The Prince of Persia for this thing. This is the CD version. Yeah. <laughs> you're right, Ken. <laughs> no. All right, here we go. Prince of Persia. This should be awesome. I have... Oh. That's pretty cool. Good music. Yeah, that's the new NFL, Rob. Okay, we gotta watch this. Let's see if there's an opening here. The music's awesome. You gotta give it that. You know, it's funny. I love this game, but I've never played it on on this system. So, let's see here. Here we go. Oh man, that looks really good. Look at that. Get my buttons down here. 
Look at that. Nice. Alright. Let's see what we got here. Alright, everything's pretty much the way you would expect it to be. Man, listen to that music. That's awesome. Plays good, too. This might be a winner, finally. Okay, I don't see the... Uh... Okay, as I recall... Yeah, there it is. <clears throat> yeah. Yeah, the Amiga could have pulled this uh, sort of sound off easily. I mean, on the, the CD32... Oh, man. See if I can pick this sucker up. I'll pick it up. Can't pick it up for some reason. There you go. Man, you had to be in the perfect spot. Hey, listen. Don't judge the uh, Turbo Graphics by what you've seen this evening. It's quite a good system. Just these games have been. I mean, I have. I didn't. I sort of randomly picked some games, and you know, ironically, the one I picked for sure was it came from the desert because I wanted to see it. So that one's on me. Oh God! Oh. <laughs> Sorry. What sport are you watching, Tech Boy? What is USA? I didn't know USA was... Is it basketball? Or what is it? World Cup of what? Is it soccer? Sorry, no one here knows jack squat about soccer. Don't believe the hype. We don't want to know either, I'll be honest with you. There we go. I'm going to get it right this time. Oh, God. I almost got it wrong. Let's see if I can do this without dying horribly. There we go. You know, in some versions of this, the skeleton comes to life. And you can see his little outline there like he could come to life. Well, pick it up, you idiot. There you go. Man, you, have to, you don't stoop down. That's weird. You're kidding me. There, hotness on the field? Yeah, it might be, Rob. Has anyone played this on the Turbo Graphics before? Anybody used to playing this one? Because it seems like a winner, and this is the kind of game, if the first level's a winner, it's pretty much a winner, right? You know, I was easing my way through this, and then that's when it says, like, oh, you're running out of time. <laughs> it controls quite well, too, I'd say. I'll have to get off this first level. I get off the first level, I, I feel like a winner. I mean, I scored a touchdown, so if I could do that, I think I could do this. God knows I've played through this level enough times. i got to figure out how to draw the sword. I hope it'll come up automatically. Oh, God! Oh, God! He chased me! Oh!
There you go. We're moving on. I can't come back from that one. I gotta figure out how to draw the sword. There you go. That's a winner. If you're gonna play some, if you're gonna play some Prince of Persia. There's your, there's the King Dong right there. Well, this is the last game on the docket tonight as we draw towards the end of the second big hour. It's almost it timed out perfectly. This is a little game we call R Type, brother. R Type complete. You know it's gold. It's complete. It is complete. So let's give this a shot. Any R Typers in here? R Type in the middle of our street. Oh, man. Oh, man. I hope a Godzilla or something happens here. Or Star Blazers or the. Some kind of. That's like if, if Chevy built a rocket. That's what it would look like right there. You got that right, Flag. Ricky DeRocher? You're here just in time for the last game, brother. It's a TurboGrafx CD extravaganza. Oh, look at this. How tranquil. Oh, look at that. Oh, birds. That's nice. Isn't that nice? Here we go. Star Blazers time. Uh-huh. No kidding, Ken. Holy smokes. Ricky, you may be right. I have no way of knowing. Look at that. Look at that. looked like the ship from Space 1999. Oh, nice. It's like a... Whoa, hello! Come on, O'Rom. You're not enjoying this? This is the story behind our type. <笑>いや、そのみかくにのうちゅうほうしゃせんのかいてきがひそかにおこなわれていた。いや、わらそうらいえ、ちゃん。いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや、いや
Yeah. Look at that guy. He's the guy you want controlling your ship. They got the dumb look on his face. Yeah. Asteroids. Well, uh, wait a minute. What's happening here? Oh! Now it's going down. Get ready. Coolest. All right, I'm kidding. Nope. There we go. All right, here we go. Now it's time. Once they start showing the ship, it's time. Man. This is like when a wrestler comes out. You get the full intro here. Yes! Let's watch him get dressed. Think of how much extra expense they went to just to have this as part of the loading process here on the ship. You got this huge metal dais that raises up to look cool. Oh man, look at that. Is that what this is? Oh, you're in deep trouble. Oh, Rob, no pressure, brother. <laughs> Listen, don't rag on Vampire Rob. Bob. All right, here we go. Yes, sir. Mm. I like charging that beam up and then just hit one guy. Just to be a jerk. I want them to know they're in trouble. Yeah, how you like them apples, jerk? Come on, come get you some. Whoa! I need that. I need it. Oh, God! This reminds me how good the uh, this was on the Spectrum. They did a great job on this. If you haven't played it, I, I strongly recommend it. Anybody here played this on the Specky? Oh, thank God, my Ziggurat just zagged. Man, make me start all over. You scumbags. Oh, okay, they didn't. Thank God. This here is hard. I'm really, That's what reminded me of the Spectre, because I always had trouble getting this little opening crevasse and that. God. Okay. It is dope. I agree with that. I talk like that, too. You just don't know it. I say dope all the time. And I, so, can you still say rad? That's something, right? Oh, oh God. Okay, never charge through there. I got it this time. Zig and zag. That's it. Come on, gimme, gimme. Get me back in there, boss. I like how it stutters. The Listen. Listen, I'm blaming... It came from the desert, took a lot out of me. That we should have known that from the Amiga thought a few years ago. It hurt boat real bad. This reminds me, I wonder if the same guy that did this song did the X-Men song. Because this one's R, 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 R. The X-Men was a a a a a X. Oh, God! Oh, Christ, no! Oh, good God, no! Did you die? Just die! No, not me! I'm gonna play this one more time. I can't go out like that. Not to mention, I want to, I want to play longer than it took us to get to that opening.
No. I'm not going down like that. Oh, God! You missile shooting scumbag. Oh, God! Yeah. Oh, good God! shoot those guys. Mental note. <laughs> I forgot to shoot those guns. Oh, God. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. That's it. I suck. I am no good. You can't have auto fire on this one because you got to shoot the mega mega weapon. Mega weapon. Listen, y'all. I know when a sucker's licked, brother, and I'm licked. You got to call it. You got to call it when it goes down. That's two hours on the dot, my friends. I have uh, greatly enjoyed uh, the games tonight. Had a lot of fun. Well, I enjoyed most of them. Uh, we will revisit a few of these games, I would wager. Uh, sometime down the line, and it won't be golf, I, I fear. But uh, thanks everyone for popping in. It was neat to hear from some folks you'll hear from that often. A lot of uh, a lot of uh, people popped in that I appreciate it. Hey, if you didn't catch the uh, radio show at the beginning of this episode, go back on uh, Twitch and listen to it. It's a real good one this week. The next two weeks you're gonna have two awesome radio shows. So even if you've never bothered, come and check them out, man. Uh, because there, there was a real good one, and the, the next two are going to be great. Uh, we'll be back tomorrow for the Taze Valley Classic Computer Club. It's going to be the bomb.com. Then me and the Brent will be around uh, on Sunday morning for ARG Presents. This week, games based on British cartoons. So this should be interesting. We, and we've had to pick each other's games. So I picked Brent a real good one, and he threw me a real oddball one. So we'll see how it goes. Should be a lot of fun. Thanks again, everybody, for checking me out. I will catch you guys on the flip side. Until next time, adios.